Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Assalamu alaikum class 1 In maths today we are going to start our new lesson subtraction Today we will deal page number 71 72 and 73 At the end of this lesson students will be able to do subtraction vertically and horizontally do word problems subtraction so let's start our lesson first i'm going to do page number 71 question number one subtract vertically and then horizontally one has been done for you this is a vertical form 19 minus 3 when 3 subtracts from 9 the number remains 6 and there is nothing to subtract from 1 so 1 remains the same now subtract horizontally subtract 3 from 19 and the number remains 16 the next is 18 minus 7 when 7 subtracts from 8 the number remains 1 and there is nothing to subtract from 1 so 1 remains the same now subtract horizontally when 7 subtracts from 18 the number remains 11 the next one is subtract 3 from 5 so when 3 subtracts from 5 the number remains 2 now subtract horizontally subtract 3 from 5 and the number remains 2 the next one is 6 minus 1 Now you tell me when 1 subtracts from 6 what number comes? Yes, the number comes 5. Now subtract 1 from 6 in horizontal form. So when 1 subtracts from 6 the number remains yes 5. So the answer is 5. The next is subtract 7 from 7 in vertical form. So when 7 subtracts from 7, what number remains? Yes, the number remains 0. Now subtract 7 from 7 in horizontal form. So when 7 subtracts from 7, the number remains 0 that means 7 minus 7 equals to 0 the next is subtract 6 from 16 first subtract 6 from 6 what number remains yes the number remains 0 when 6 subtracts from 6 the number remains 0 now there is nothing to subtract from 1 so we write here 1 that means when 6 subtracts from 16 the number remains 10 now subtract 6 from 6 in horizontal form so when 6 subtracts from 16 the number remains 10 Now I am going to do page number 72 Word Problems Subtraction Here is an example Uzma takes 4 sweets from a bottle of 10 sweets How many sweets are left in the bottle? 
There are ten sweets in a bottle. Uzma took four sweets. So how many left? Look, there are six sweets are left in a bottle. That means when four subtracts from ten, the number remains six. Here is another example. Twelve children are playing after school. Five go home to watch TV. How many children are left? Let's find. Twelve children are playing and five go home to watch TV. Let's subtract to find how many are left. Subtract five from twelve. Look, five go home to watch TV. Then how many are left? Yes, seven children are left. That means twelve minus five equals to seven. Seven children are left. Now I'm going to do page number seventy-three. Word problems subtraction. Question number one. Write the sum in the box and find the answer. The first one is seven mangoes are on a plate. Maha eats three mangoes. How many are left on the plate? Seven mangoes on a plate, and Maha eats three from the plate. Did you notice how many are left? Yes, there are four mangoes left on the plate. That means when three subtracts from seven, the number remains four. The next one is there are fourteen children in a team. Each of them are boys. How many? Girls are there in a team. Let's find out. There are fourteen children. Eight of them are boys. Can you tell me how many girls are there? Yes, there are six girls in the team. That means fourteen minus eight equals to six. So when eight subtracts from fourteen. the number remains 6 so students this is the end of my lesson hopefully you have understood the lesson now attempt page number 71 and 73 as your homework on your countdowns book hope you all will do well thank you